Pod XT gives you everything that you need to get a great bass tone, whether you're playing live or you're recording in the studio. It's all of your amp tone, your cabs, your effects, and even the microphones that you've used to mic up a bass cab, all in one complete package. You know, I started out just using the guitar pod, because that was the only one that was around at that point, so I was using that one to record bass through. But it sounded pretty cool, and it just it was a good way to get the kind of an amp effect on the bass really easily. But then when the bass pod came out, I, I was just in heaven. It was total salvation for me in lots of ways. Having a lot of flexibility with sounds, but also having a portable package. It was just the perfect thing for bass players. It almost makes more sense for bass players and guitar players, in a way, just in terms of the portability. You know, guitar players have it easy when they can bring a beautiful little single 12-inch old combo to a recording session with bass players, you know. For the righteous bass tone, sometimes have to bring like a, a full 810 stack and the whole issue, you know. Gotta get a guy to help you sometimes or whatever, and, and uh, I can get a sound a lot like that out of the bass pod. The XG series um, improved upon a good thing. Like for me, I really thought the original bass pod sounded great. It sounded great to me. When the XT came out, it added sort of a wider dimension to the sound and more depth, it seemed to me, more organic, more of a breathing, organic tone. Um, to such an extent that now the XT series of, of uh, bass pods I can use in any circumstance, even in, with the most scrutinizing producers and engineers, I can use that stuff and, and get a get a really desirable bass sound for any project. No matter what style you play, and no matter what kind of bass tone you're looking for, you'll find exactly what you need in Bass Pod XT. Definitely, the best thing about having the pod in the studio is just all the effects that it has in it, all the different amps you have available, and really. Ever since I've gotten strung out, um, being in a studio, every studio I've been to, everyone has a pod. Yeah, the Bass Pod XT series is definitely a, a must-have if you're in the studio because it allows you, to, you know, to change to basically any bass tone that any producer might ask you to get. And uh, everything's right there at your fingertips. It's really easy. You can walk in with real usable options, and you don't have to bring a truckload of gear with you to a session. That's basically it. There are 28 different bass amps and 22 different cabinets that you can mix and match for an incredible variety of tone. There's everything from a little single speaker combo to a full 8x10 stack all the way up to a super clean bass preamp. A working bass player doesn't always have access to a vintage magnetone amplifier or a Marshall Super Bass or a high watt you know, 200 or these kinds of things. These are expensive, vintage, generally unreliable pieces that are hard to come by, hard to move, whatever. And uh, also, you're not going to have an occasion to use things like that all the time. It's not the, Those more esoteric amplifiers are not something you're going to bring with you to every gig, right? It's not the standard. Maybe there's other things that are more standard, like, you know, things like um, the, the, the classic models and things like that that are in the base on HD Pro. But um, those more esoteric amps are really useful in certain cir circumstances. So having them on tap, but not having to bring them or own them or pay for them or maintain them, big plus. You can forget about having to haul around a massive pedal board full of unreliable stomp boxes, because BassPod XT totally has you covered. There are over 50 effects, 
In addition to the six-band semi-parametric EQ and the studio quality limiter, you've got stomp boxes and studio effects of everything from different flavors of distortion, synth and filter effects, modulations, and even delays and reverbs. If you do a lot of recording in pro studios, or if you're looking to put together a live rack, Bass Pod XT Pro has all the additional connections that you need to get the job done. It's got XLR balanced outputs, AES EBU and SPDIF in and out, and an effects loop. Bass Pod XT also has a USB jack for a direct digital connection to your computer. You can use this for digital recording or to use Line 6 Edit. Line 6 Edit is a free software editor library you can download from line6.com. Let you get in and tweak every parameter and see it visually right there on the screen, as well as organize banks of sounds on your computer. If you're a working, gigging bass player, the Bass Pod XT series is definitely going to make your life way easier. Bass player's got to have a few things. He's got to have some great instruments. He's got to have a couple of good effects. I recommend, uh, you know, he has a really nice tuner. You know, just kind of the basic toolbox of a bass player. And frankly, if he's going to start doing work and uh, in, in the studio and maybe have some work that has some variety to it, I think you need a bass pod XT Pro to make it happen. It's convenient, you know, the convenience of it being there. And it's, it all, they sound good too, which is cool. And you can tweak all the different effects tweak the different amp sounds and stuff so you get what you like, you know, and add a little flavor to your amp too if you wanted to. So, it's awesome. A Bass Pod XT is, in my opinion, now a must. So plug in, spin the knob, and hear for yourself why in studios the world over, Bass Pod XT is the standard for bass time.